name is Melanie Sanford, and I am the Arthur F. Thurnau Professor of Chemistry at the University of Michigan. My current research is focused on developing new ways of making organic chemicals. That may sound kind of generic, but it turns out organic chemicals are in incredibly important for everything from energy utilization and petroleum to pharmaceuticals and agrochemicals, all the way to um, sort of beauty products, things like you know shampoos and, and conditioners and, and perfumes. So what we've been developing are, are catalysts or sequences of catalysts that will actually take CO2, which you know is the main, um, the main emission that's, that's leading to global warming. Um, and we're working on developing catalysts that will actually take CO2 um, along with hydrogen and turn it back into methanol, which is a useful fuel. So the idea would be that ultimately one would be able to capture the CO2 that we're releasing from combustion and be able to use a series of chemical transformations to actually reconvert it into fuel, thereby precluding the release of it into the atmosphere and, and leading to global warming. One of the most important chemical processes in the world is takes um, nitrogen gas and hydrogen gas and turns it into ammonia, which is the absolutely critical part of, of fertilizer. It's one of the most important reactions in the world because it makes the fertilizer for um, you know, feeding the world. This uses a huge amount of worldwide energy demand. So I, I think I've seen estimates about 5% of worldwide energy usage goes towards this process. So if you can develop new catalysts that utilize less energy, you could have a huge transformative impact on, on the world and, and how, how um, fertilizer is made. We're really deeply interested and passionate about understanding um, the mechanisms of these processes. So we really want to understand not just how to take molecule A and turn it into molecule B, but we really want to understand how the different catalysts that are operating actually work, what the molecular steps are that they use to get from point A to point B. In terms of what we're going to do in the future, I think um, there's so many exciting things to do, and I think that um, this MacArthur grant is, is a great opportunity to start thinking about them and, and really pursuing them. Um, and current funding organizations are, I th would say, traditionally very conservative, so they don't like to fund things that are new and unexplored. They like to have a lot of preliminary results already. And so this will give me an opportunity to explore things that would have been very risky to get funded through traditional sources, but now can be, um, can be supported through this, this um, fellowship. Mm -hmm.